everyone welcome to my youtube channel in this tutorial i will show you how to create a super quick circular array of cubes so first things first here we look at an interesting way to do a circular array using a method which is completely non-destructive and therefore very flexible since it deforms the objects in the array it is especially useful for specific cases where that is required, like uh, making a cylindrical wall like you would see in a well or a chimney. So scale the default cube as shown in our example on the x-axis, head x, s then x, scale it on x-axis, just like this until you get something break shaped that's right today the life of the default cube is spared be careful that you scale along the x-axis and not the y-axis create a busy circle by pressing shift a shift a go to curve the busy circle like this Scale it up by pressing S like this and moving the mouse it's probably hidden inside the cube initially select cube and add bevel modifier let's add the bevel modifier it's over here then an array modifier let's add array modifier like this let's add the third modifier which is curve modifier choose the busy circle as the object in the curve modifier let's go back scroll down until you see the panel of the curve modifier so go over this uh, box this empty box as shown here we have the eye dropper so just want to select busy curve which is the busy circle in our example so now let's move to array modifier scroll up to the mouse wheel we have the array modifier just want to set uh, set it to feed type feed type set it to fixed account Exit account as shown here and manually increase the count until you get enough duplicates to complete the loop it's gonna be adding and making this array just uh, you should scale the busy circle as shown in our example just like this i'm gonna be adding other uh, i'm gonna be adding other detailing later now let's add another modifier another array modifier to stack the bricks ver vertically by setting the z value of the relative offset to one so let's add another array modifier zoom out and as you can see we have created uh, we have added another uh, circular array of uh, cubes so how to make it uh, should be set to the axis the increase the count value until you get the height you want go to the bottom set it to zero just to want to set it to z and play around with this value of the z in order to set the height like this hit three for side view just 
I want to set it like this. I think this will be fine as shown in our tutorial. You can increase the count like this. If you want to have uh, this construction taper towards the top, select all vertices of the curve in edit uh, mode by pressing E and then tilt with Ctrl T. And I have added also subdivision surface modifier, set it to level 2 as shown here. I do have created this circular array of uh, cubes and it's pretty amazing. So just set it shade smooth, shade it smooth and auto smooth. And we have created this array, circular array of cubes. It's great and you can do it yourself. That's it. Thanks for watching.